good evidence that the daily joys of health, the daily vitamins that keep us healthy, uh, can be summarized in the acronym CLANGERS, and that stands for Connect, Learn, Be Active, Notice, Give Back, Eat Well, Relax, Sleep. By the look in your eyes You got so much soul Okay, so Sunny and Jasmine, could you please tell us about what Connect means to you? What Connect means to me is having a bond with someone, taking the time to understand and listen to them. When I connect with someone, I can be myself. And showing connection is showing empathy, love and understanding. I think connect means like socialising with other people because it makes everybody like happy and you're connecting with other people. Is good for you because you can learn about the human body and different stuff about science and if you want to be a scientist you can. I like to learn history because it's really interesting. I like to learn doing maths because I like all the numbers. I like doing five person English because you can learn brand new stuff. Makes me feel happy because I'm learning. And it uh, makes you feel like you can write. So much so. You got something. And you're going to be on the bikes and you can be running around and being active. Okay? So on Friday our class decided to go on about noticing and we drew some pictures about what we should notice outside of the world. Noticing wildlife and everything around us is nice, but it's not just like what's around us. For example, if you have a best friend and you know them really well, and then you can notice they're acting differently, then you can ask them if they're okay. They might say yes as a response, but you have to notice sometimes that they could be not telling you why. Um, noticing those things make me feel really relaxed and calm. I think it's important to notice because just um, just looking at a screen all day isn't very healthy. So you can get outside, have a walk, and notice like changes in nature, like flowers blooming, birds tweeting, and the trees blowing in the wind. So Joseph, Lizzie, and Bobby, could you please tell us what give means to you? I think giving is a kind thing to do and you should always do it when you're like, if you're feeling sad or you're feeling happy. If you have more than one thing, you should give it to other people. To give something to someone makes me feel glad and proud. Sometimes if you decide to give something to someone, it might make them feel happy because some people might not have those things. Some examples of, way, of ways you can give are li really listening to someone Thanking, thanking them for something they have done for you and spending time with someone who needs it. We like it, Mr. J, J, K. When you eat and more, we like it, Mr. J, J, K. When you rock it. grapes because they are juicy um carrots my favorite healthy food is strawberries apples because they help me get out my warby tooth my favorite vegetable is cucumber because it's green i like it they're good 
for your mental health and it keeps you healthy and you, it keeps you really growing. I can tell by the words in your song. To relax, we sing colour and we we sing colour and we um, and we sing songs to our brother and sisters and we read books. I sometimes lie down on my bed or my sofa to relax and watch some microphones on the TV or read a book. It makes me feel calm. I like to uh, do like colouring and it makes me feel calm. When you rock and roll we like it with the J, J, K. This is for sleep and you need sleep so you can focus when you wake up. If you don't get sleep, when you're working or if you're in class, you can, you can easily fall asleep because of how tired you are. So you need to get at least 8 to 12 hours of sleep. If you don't go to sleep, you wouldn't, you wouldn't be able to learn or you wouldn't, you wouldn't be focusing in classes. If you have a good night's sleep, then, then you'll be able to focus more and and then you can have a happy day. Well, if you don't sleep, then you won't be able to do much. 